the championship season starts for Dewsbury and Whitehaven and what has season 2021 got in store for both these famous sides as Whitehaven have first use of the ball field position Newton to Williams to Dixon Dixon out to McNally and they are going to cross in the corner and Whitehaven have opened the scoring and it's the former South Sydney Rabbit Hole, Lachlan Wormsley and it's Whitehaven who lead Dewsbury here at the Tetley Stadium by four points to nil. It's Garrett now playing the ball, dazing at dummy half to Anniking, absolutely Two, relentless three, there, five. like a little Yorkshire Orton. Terrier. As it goes from Sam Day, and yes. Sam Day's got the ball down for mine, and Sam Day has just come on the field, and Dewsbury Rams have their first points of the new championship season. It's underneath the black dot there, and it's an easy conversion for Paul Sykes, but look at this, Tommy. This is what you want in it just before half time. Jack, um, Sam Day's come on straight off the bench and he's, he's brought an impact straight in. Wormsley, and Wormsley oh, is brought down and there is the half-time hooter. Well, it's been a real tight, tense affair here. Just a try apiece and two points separating the Rams and Whitehaven. Six points to four, just two points the difference. Wormsley gets us back underway. 40 minutes separate these two sides between their first point or points Hull. of the Hull. new championship season Hull. one of Whitehaven's Hull. great Hull. rugby league moments Hull. Jed Stokes on the field at the end Whitehaven beating Salford by 26 points to 22 carry. good carry Hull. there from Walton offloads the ball here goes Sykes Sykes to Fleming Fleming has the line ahead Hull. open of him Fleming Hull. against Williams and try. Fleming he's got to score a sensational try for the Dewsbury Rams it's their second of the evening and they have broken the second half deadlock and look at that from Matt Fleming the former St. Tellens and London Broncos centre played against the Australian schoolboys back in 2019 and he will be looking to make an impact Great. but here's a player making an impact it's Michael Knowles Great. and it's oh. going to be Matt Fleming again Fleming to the corner Sorry. it's a sensational try here money in the bank from Matt Fleming what a break it was from Michael Knowles he sucked in that Whitehaven defence and Matt Fleming two tries in two minutes Dewsbury have a stranglehold at long last on this game just a little over six minutes remaining here as it goes down the middle now with Tomlinson. Tomlinson, three grey and green shirted defenders on him. It goes back to Finn. Finn for the crucial one point between the posts. And Liam Finn will extend Dewsbury's lead here. And that will be the game you feel because they have a crucial free score cushion now. It's 17 points to four. And just like we've said, Paul Sykes, Liam Fain. It's not often you've got that combined age of 76 in the halfbacks. Jason Mossop wanting to quickly take it. It'll be Aidan Brogan who will take it. They'll move the ball over on that left hand edge of Whitehaven. They are going to cross in at the corner. The referee will look to the touch judge and he will point the finger and that is James Worthington who slid over out wide no it's not James Worthington it apologies Mossop? it is it's yeah, Mossop it's old man Mossop <laughs> one but with Move seconds left here Hold with me. at the Tetley Stadium lads. in Dewsbury it Aiden. is going to be the Dewsbury Rams one. who start the season with two points Hall oh, brought down there and there we have it the full time hooter sounds with Dewsbury Rams picking up their first win at home against Whitehaven since 2016.